In this video, we shall learn Unit 13, Structural Organization of Animals, Part 8, Reproductive System of Rabbit. Urinogenital system of rabbit comprises excretory system and reproductive system. In the previous video, we dealt about the excretory system. Now we shall learn about the reproductive system. Rabbit exhibits sexual dimorphism, that is, male and female sexes are separate and are morphologically different. Let's first see the male reproductive system. It consists of a pair of testes. Testis is ovoid in shape. It is enclosed by a scrotal sac in the abdominal cavity. It consists of numerous fine tubules called seminiferous tubules. Now, th this leads into a coiled tubule called epidermis. Epidermis leads into the sperm duct called vas deferens. And vas deferens joins the urethra just below the urinary bladder. Urethra passes into the penis. So, male repetitive system is related with the excretory system. Understand? Okay, now there are three accessory glands, namely prostate gland, corpus gland, perineal gland. So, so this is again a two mark question. What are the three accessory glands present in male repetitive system in rabbit? What are they? Prostate gland, corpus gland, perineal gland. So, male repetitive system has a pair of testes. They are ovoid in shape. It is enclosed by a scrotal sac. It has fine tubules called seminiferous tubules. Seminiferous tubules leads to a coiled tubule called epidermis. Epidermis leads to a leads to vast difference. It joins to urethra just below the urinary bladder. And urethra passes into the penis. And three glands support the reproduction. Now we shall learn about the female reproductive system. Uh, in the female reproductive system consists of a pair of ovaries. Ovaries are small ovoid structures and they are located behind the kidneys in the abdominal cavity. From each side of the ovary arises a funnel shaped op opening called oviduct. The anterior part of the oviduct leads to the fallopian tube. Yeah, which leads to the uterus. Uterus joins together to form vagina. The common tube formed by the union of urinary bladder and the vagina is called urinogenital canal. So what is urinogenital canal? The common tube formed by the union of urinary bladder and the vagina is called urinogenital canal or vestibule. This runs backwards and opens to a slit, a small opening called vulva. Like uh, male reproductive system, uh, female, female reproductive system has also a pair of corpus gland and perineal gland which helps in reproduction. Male and the female reproductive images are given here. Which labeled part helps you identify male reproductive system and female reproductive system? In the male reproductive system, a particular label is rounded testis. So by looking at that, you can say it is a male reproductive structure. In the second picture, a particular part is rounded. So that shows it is female reproductive structure. So testis or the male reproductive structure leads to the epidermis. Epidermis leads to the vas deferens. Vas deferens leads to the penis. So now these are the parts of male reproductive structure. Similarly in the female, the ovary from the ovary, fallopian tube, and from the fallopian tube, it leads to the vagina and the vagina to the vestibule vestibule to the vulva. So this all these are the parts that help us to identify male and the female reproductive structures. Thank you girls. 
see you next class have a nice day